Skadoosh, skadoosh. Welcome back to the channel, my ninjas. This is going to be a fun one. Um, I'm, I've already given this away. The winner will be announced for this. This is for the Angel of Invention foil and a pack, of course, at 2019. I'm going to crack that open and announce the winner in just a bit. I'm going to bust open these Exelon Standard Showdown packs for the channel. And these cards over here. Uh, they will be given away in combination with each. So you get the mountain, you get the blood moon, you get the swamp, you get the fatal push, you get the planes, you get the path to exile. Yes, they're all signed by yours truly. So hopefully only fans of the channel are going to be uh, commenting on this one. I'm going to explain exactly uh, how to go about winning these. And yes, they were given away in a past video at the 40K, but my stupid self couldn't find it. It was too much of a headache for me. Yada, yada, yada. Anyway, I decided I'm just going to give them away in this video. We're about to hit 45,000, whatever. Let's do that. So pay attention on how to get your hands on these bad boys right here. Also on the backs, I haven't signed it. 40K, PLA, bad boy gaming. So, I mean, it's even a little bit, a little something above and beyond. Uh, a little special thing because 40,000 was awesome and I couldn't have done it without all you guys. Enough of me talking here. Let's get into this. I'll announce this in a second and how to do the other thing. But first, I want to crack open these Ixalan packs and give shout outs to Christian Ringer. Uh, Rich Van Alta, Andres O'Brien, Adam Storm, Outlaw XX, Justin Murphy, James Girton, Brian Stanley, Devin Heyer, Richard Price, Chad Erickson, and Dustin Bates. I appreciate you guys sincerely. Thank you. Let's get up into this. Hallowed One is our first pool. By the way, you can get these off eBay. I paid, I think, $7.50 for each of them or $8 bucks for each. I can't remember exactly. Between seven and nine, they usually go for. Or you can win them at your uh, local game store on like Sunday, Saturday event, something like that, or FNM. All that good stuff. So, oh my God. Oh, all right, all right. That caught me off guard. That caught me off guard. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That kind of happens. Nicole Bullis, God Pharaoh, nasty. Uh, we just pulled that sucker. These things are amazing. Uh, target, as you guys know, target opponent exiles cards from the top of his or her library until he or she exiles a non-land card. Until end of turn, you may cast that card without paying its mana cost. This card has single-handedly destroyed me in many matches, just saying. Each opponent exiles two cards from his or her hand. It's a minus four. Uh, good old Bolas God Pharaoh deals seven damage to target opponent or creature an opponent controls. It's minus 12. Exile each non-land permanent your opponent's control. It says opponent. That's insane. Holy smokes. All right. Amazing card. Oh, my God. This has never, I mean, never happened. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. We just pulled. What? Da, 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 da. All right. All right. Calm down. Get a hold of yourself, man. All right. All right. All right. Cardboard crack in the house. All right. Wow. That is, that's, this is unique. This is a really unique experience. Okay. I don't, that, I've never done that. I just pulled a mythic Nicole Bullis in one pack, and then in the next pack, a Nissa Steward of Elements foil. Holy crap. That's stupid. Uh, please thumbs this video up. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Wow. All right. All right. Yeah, so you got the scry, too. Look at the top card of your library. If it's a land card or a creature card with converted mana costs uh, less than or equal to the number of loyalty counters on Nissa Steward of Elements, you may put that card on the battlefield. Minus six and tap up a two-target land you control. They become five, five elemental creature tokens with flying and haze until end of turn. They are still lands. Holy crap. What a freaking pack, man. Uh, and then we got uh, Rebecca Gay, uh, Foil Mountain in the back. Oh, my gosh. Let's get a load of that shininess, though. That is just, that's adorable. That's adorable. You are precious there, Nissa. Nissa, you are truly precious. Oh, my gosh. All right. Uh, just quickly to announce this winner. Um, yeah, Angel of Invention, the person that got this. I asked a simple question. What's your favorite card right now? Uh, I think I said in standard and whatnot. Um, and the person that got that right... Uh, oh, wait, this is supposed to be for an anointed procession. I'm sorry. So you're not going to get the angel of invention. You're going to get an anointed procession. Um, oh God, I'm so slow. Anyway, uh, course at 2019 and an anointed procession. And that is going to shink Lars Clayson. If you want uh, this card instead of the anointed procession, it's completely up to you. You have to email me, my dude, at mossbergswerve at gmail.com. That's M-O-S-B-E-R-G-S-W-E-R-V-E -E -E at gmail.com. And you're going to get what's up inside of here, man. Uh, he said his favorite card is Anointed Procession because it makes my cat life gain deck awesome. 
I did set that aside. As you guys see, I'm terrible with giveaways, man. I am just terrible with giveaways. But you're going to get everything inside of here as well. So anointed procession plus all this, or you can have your choice of the angel invention. Canyon slow. Oh, my God, man. Why are we on so much fire? I swear. I mean, I do have a fire crotch. I'm just saying, I have red hair. But, oh, my God, I feel like my pants are about to explode. This is a serious, stupid video right now. Yeah, I get silly when I do openings. I don't give a shit. All right, Omniscience. Wow. Omniscience. You may cast spells from your hand without paying their mana cost. Holy crap. All right. And the canyon slope. Wow, 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 wow. Man. The foil planes. The foil planes. Elena Danner. Rams with Tanner. Oh, my God. Dude. Dude. Bro. Bro, oh my god! I this I've never opened back to back stupid amazing packs. Are you freaking kidding me right now? And this one's being given away. Are you freaking kidding me right now? Oh my god! This has to be one of the best openings I've ever done. Just had like just a few packs to crack, and oh my gosh, Jade Light freaking Ranger foil, Canyon Slow, uh, whatever. And a freaking planes. Congratulations. You're going home a winner. Wow. That's awesome. Make sure you email me. M-O-S-B-E-R-G-S-W-E-R-V-E -E -E at gmail.com. Also, make sure you comment in here so I know it's you. All that good stuff. Holy smokes, man. Congratulations. Again, that person's name, Lars Clayson. Ridiculous, dude. And all he had to do was just share my content and comment on a video. That's all he had to do. And thumbs up. Just goes to show I appreciate you guys. All right. Holy smokes. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Wow. I... Stop it. I can't even open this right now. I think I just screwed up this opening. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this kind of stuff only happens on Bad Boy Gaming. <laughs> we got our handy-dandy scissors here. All right. I did not cut the cards. I hope not. Dear lordy lordy. Let's slide these puppies out. Swing! We got a Deep Root Champion, so things are finally slowing down here. Oh, my gosh. Deep Root Champion's cool. Whenever you cast an accurate spell, put a plus one, plus one counter on Deep Root Champion. I really want to put this in a deck. I make a deck. I mean, what happened to Merfolk, man? Does anyone have an answer? What happened to Merfolk? They always went downhill. Uh, they all like, they all stink now. Wildfire Eternal, afflict for four. Cool. Whenever uh, Wildfire Eternal attacks and isn't blocked, you may cast an instant or sorcery card from your hand without paying its mana cost. Wildfire Eternal. Yeah, this card stinks. I don't know what else to say on that one. <laughs> uh, Vicious Conquistador. It's a cool card. It saw a lot of play. Uh, still does in standard. Whenever Vicious Conquistador attacks, each opponent loses one life. Pretty cool card. I did make a deck with that card, and it does pretty good. Swamp, Basic Land, the Rebecca Gay. Nice. Nice. Man, what a, a silly opening so far. Um, for those of you who are interested in winning these guys over here, so you get this and this... On the back of each of these cards is a number. The number, there's three different numbers. You can only pick one. Pick one number. Uh, you're not allowed. Any edits will not, uh, well, we, well they'll, they'll be disqualified. Any, any edited comments will be disqualified, and you can only guess one number one time. Any duplicate comments on this video, you're disqualified as well. So you can only enter once. First person... Obviously, the first person who guesses the correct numbers on the back of these cards is the person who's going to win it. You only get one crack at it. Uh, good luck, guys. Good luck. One to 200. One to 200, all right? And three people will be chosen. And uh, as soon as they're picked, I mean, I'll start announcing that. I'm going to be on top of this one. I do apologize for not being on top of the last one. Uh, we are starting off with a shadowed Caravel. Caravel, sure. Whenever a creature you control explores, put a plus one, plus one counter on shadowed Caravel. Crew for Deuce. There you go. Master Trinketeer. Something uh, to soften up this heavy load we had. Oh my gosh. Servos and Thopters you control get plus one, plus one. For four, create a one, one colorless servo artifact creature token. Oh, Secret Salvage. Uh, foil. Nothing crazy, though. Uh, but it is a nice little shiny card. I'll give it that. Exile target non that card from your graveyard. Search your library for any number of cards with the same name as that card. Reveal them and put them onto the into your hand and shuffle your library. Sweet. And then we got the Foil Forest by Rebecca Gay yet again. Pretty sweet. Last pack to crack, Captain. Maybe we'll get something stupid. Up, oh, that is stupid looking already. Wildfire Eternal. Pretty dumb looking card. I am. You know, I'm really sick. 
I'm really sick of seeing on this card. I'm just saying. Really. Oh my God. Bro, 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 bro. Woo. Oh man, you, I think I just went into like some weird. Uh, uh, what was that? Uh, a freaking Seven Dwarves or whatever. Some Disney Channel just happened. I don't know what just came out of my mouth. A uh, Johnny Unyielding. Freaking mythic. Wow, these are the best Ixalan standard showdown prize packs I've ever opened on this channel. I mean, this is just stupid. Uh, a Johnny Unyielding. Amazing. Planeswalker. Uh, reveal the top three cards of your library. Put all nine land permanent cards re uh, revealed this way into your hand and the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. Exile target creature. Its controller gains life equal to its power. It's minus nine. Put five plus one plus one counters on each creature you control and five loyalty counters on each other Planeswalker you control. Hot diggity damn. Honored Hydra foil. We calm down a bit. Oh, man. That was nutty. I don't know what to say. Uh, that's a foil. Nice trample. Uh, embalm. Yeah, 6-6. Six, six. There you go. And a forest in the back. What? Okay, there's four cards. I was like, where's the other card at? So, pretty stupid opening today. Uh, yeah. Please, guys. I, I appreciate all your thumbs up. It helps a smaller YouTuber like me. Um, I'm, I'm not that big as some of you might think. Uh, but, yeah, definitely smash that like button. Uh, I appreciate it. I love you guys. And, uh, yeah, 1 through 200. Uh, give it a guess. Good luck. PLA. Oh, and share the video. Sharing is caring. It's a really good opening. Might as well share it. PLA.